Christopher Payne from Kodak, and this is your eighth time here at the Drupa. You came here the first time in your 20s. That's quite unbelievable. Welcome back to the Drupa. I hope you're doing well and having a good time. Well, thanks for having me. I love Drupa. It's the Olympics of printing. <laughs> That's a good thing to say, yeah. yeah. Why would you say that? Uh, so this is the only show in the world where every vendor is here and you really, you come once every four years and you show all your new technology and customers truly come from around the world. The amount of interest we have from all corners of the globe is really great and you can come here and get a lot of business done in, it, it, it is 10 days, but you can do an awful lot of business in those 10 days and meet people that come from different parts of the world. So it's very, very convenient for us and the customers. And it's really busy here at the stand, especially because of what you've done with the stand. It's, it looks really, really great. Um, what exactly have you done for the Drupa? So Kodak's a relatively big company in the industry. We did something quite different with our booth. We've themed it in terms of urban regeneration, and it really signifies the regeneration of the industry and that printing is here for good. Many of the things that you're going to see on our booth, many different technologies, but are geared towards print being here for the long term, so the markets that are going to be here because they're going to last a long time, like packaging, but also signifying what print has to do as we move forward relative to things like sustainability and being ecologically safe. Uh, because it's regeneration and urban regeneration, you'll find on our stand not just the technology, but all the applications our customers do every day. So we're standing in our convenience store called the Street Box, and here you can feast your eyes literally on all the products that come from our customers around the world, showing the real advances in packaging printing, and they're really, really um, great examples of what our customers are doing as we change the flexo industry in this case. You're also going to find a newspaper stand uh, on the store that shows newspapers, a book stand, uh, and you'll see those showing our digital printing technology and our offset product technology. So it's a great demonstration, and the customers love it. We've got cafes and music and entertainment as well. So we're having, trying to have some fun at the same time as, uh, as selling our products. Can you give me one significant example? So we're, I'm going to give you two examples. Um, we really have a lot of new technologies, over 20 new products, and like three or four new technologies. Um, the technologies that we really have, we have uh, UltraStream, which is our latest innovation in inkjet printing technology. It's de being deployed to lots of applications, books, newspapers, uh, packaging, and you'll find it actually across the show floor in about uh, six or seven different stands with our vendor partners. Uh, most of those partners like Man Roland and Bobst um, who integrate our products into theirs. Uh, UltraStream is a key inkjet technology not for us but the industry. The other one is Ultra NX. Ultra NX is a technology also and we're showing that in terms of the future of the packaging industry. Today all of our customers do this but the packaging world is not ecologically sound. Uh, Ultra NX is really the next generation of product that's going to take the packaging industry to be environmentally conscious, but at the same time drive the things the brands also love, which is um, great image quality and superior production efficiencies for our printer converters. Th those are two key technology highlights, and of course, Drupa is a place where people come and show vision. It's not just about selling today's products, it's about selling the vision of where the industry is going, and that's why I picked these two. So that's where the industry is going. Um, what, what do you think will be happening in the next four or five years apart from what you just uh, said? So we, we believe in the next four or five years, the real focus for the printing industry for Kodak is obviously a focus on uh, print for good, which means all the applications where printing uh, will really add value. It adds value in lots of ways. If you think about what we're doing in Inkjet, it's all about uh, the print product uh, working with the internet and that's where our inkjet technology is really helping our customers. In packaging we really believe packaging stays for a very long time and we're focused there. Clearly uh, Kodak's mandate moving forward is not just providing great technologies but also making sure that the industry moves to being ecologically conscious and sustainable and it's a mix of delivering that environmental footprint that our customers and the consumers need but also delivering the other things the customer needs, which is print quality and obviously production efficiency. Um, sustainability won't come just because people want sustainability. It's got to meet all those other business benefits too. Absolutely. Mr. Payne, thank you so much for your time today and enjoy your time here at the Drupal. I hope to see you for your ninth time then next time. Thank yeah, you so I, much. I hope to be back here for my ninth time and thank you very much for hosting us. Thank you so much.